From Florida to Texas to the Carolinas, these glistening balloon-like sea creatures called Portuguese man-of-wars are literally setting sail as beach season kicks off. A shifting wind pattern will sometimes force hundreds of the individuals up onto shore where they're washed up on the beach. Lifeguards flying purple flags to warn of the lurking danger. Portuguese men are, are, are pretty terrible. They, they are very, very painful. Their tentacles dangling as long as 165 feet below the surface are loaded with toxins that can sting you even after they're dead and wash ashore. 20-year-old college student Hannah Almanzar was stung while on spring break in Florida. She says she felt a slight pinch on her chest within minutes of entering the water. I thought at first it was just like my bathing suit. And then I felt it was just like kind of like burning everywhere else. Almanzar rushed to the ER for help, where she received an injection of an anti-inflammatory medicine for the increasing pain. I kind of thought for a moment that I'm like either was going to die or was going to be close to it just because of how bad it like just how bad the pain was because I never felt anything like that. While man of wars are found in tropical waters year round, they are spotted more frequently on U.S. coasts in the spring and summertime. Experts say if you do get stung, vinegar is your best bet. Spray or pour it on the wound to neutralize the venom. Do not touch the area with your hands. Instead, scrape the skin with an object like a credit card to remove the residue. And make sure to soak the area in hot water to get rid of any remaining toxins. The venom in those tentacles, extremely powerful, and in very rare cases, especially for those with allergies, it can be fatal, guys. Scary. All oh. right, thank you, Carrie. That's scary. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.